More than four months after he was poisoned, Russian opposition activist Alexei Navalny returned to his home country. But the flight from Berlin to Moscow ended with his arrest. News Nation's Felicia Bolton joins us from the newsroom with the latest. Felicia. Nicole and Aaron, Navalny's arrest may come as no surprise for many within his country. Russia's prison service said it would do everything it could to take him into custody upon his return. However, his supporters are questioning the reason and timing. Shortly after landing in Moscow today, four masked police officers met Navalny at passport control and arrested him. After kissing his wife on the cheek, he walked away with them. The officers did not explain why they were taking him into custody. However, he is accused of violating parole terms from a suspended sentence related to an embezzlement conviction in 2014. <laughs> Navalny received some applause when he boarded the airplane earlier in Berlin. He joked with journalists and said he was not afraid and did not believe he would be arrested. Meanwhile, in Moscow, his supporters protested in and outside of the airport ahead of his arrival. Police arrested some of them, although it's still not clear why. The 44-year-old's return home comes nearly five months since he collapsed on an airplane while flying back to Moscow from Siberia. His allies say his tea was poisoned. UK officials say it was the same nerve agent that was used to poison former Russian spy and his daughter in England. Navalny was temporarily placed into a medical, medically induced coma. It's still too early to see what long-term effects that poison had on him. Navalny says Russia's president, Vladimir Putin, was behind his poisoning. However, the Kremlin says there is no evidence of that. As for his return trip home, he was reportedly not under any pressure to leave Germany and fly back to Moscow. Nicole? All right, Felicia.